Hey, what's up guys, Fabio here. Just released my new video, and today I'm gonna give you a little bike check of all my Canyon models I used in the video. Let's go. I've seen in the video I used four different bikes. I used the Trials bike, the Spectral, the Torque and another Torque with a double crown. So let's dive deeper into each of them. So first off is my signature Trials bike. I developed it together with Canyon over the past two years. I used it for all of the trial scenes, street scenes, um, jumping onto the benches, doing a tail whip off or also doing a super techy trials line. You can ride everything with it which makes it super fun, um, really solid bike. I also used a different paint job, which you might have seen, the black one. It's basically just the exact same setup, same bike. Everything's the same except of the paint job because we wanted to have that obviously in the video because it's part of the whole story. All right, let's jump to the next one. The Canyon Spectral, the Ultimate Street Jib Machine. Um, very unique bike, unique setup. One of the main features is that we grind it down one of the rear sprockets. So I can basically roll backwards without the need of pedaling backwards, which makes it super fun, especially for tricks like doing the fake nose manner down the stairs and then rolling out. Just makes it easier, more stylish, I think. Another one is we have longer cables here, so I'm able to do bar spins. The seat, I always put it quite low, just because the setup is very trussy, um, very playful. Also, my signature parts, Escalade parts, uh, handlebar stem. Very important part of this bike are the brakes. These are the Magura MT7 brakes, 203 millimeters, a rear and front disc. Just super powerful, especially when going back on my nose uh, downstairs. You gotta make sure your brakes are perfect. So i um, super happy with them. Then also the suspension, my Erlin suspension. I prefer to ride them a little bit stiffer. Just gives me a bit more feedback when I'm riding street, just makes it more poppy. Other than that, it's basically the same setup as a normal Spectral. I love the bike. It's like really playful. You can jump around, you can just get very creative with that bike. So that's like a perfect fit for me. The Canyon Torque in my signature colorway, basically the proper Enduro mountain bike. I use it for all the trail clips, riding steep trails, especially in Finale Ligure, like honestly, that. DH man downhill track is insane, super steep, super rocky. So if you need a bit more suspension for your trails, for jumps, this is like the perfect setup. I've got 29 front, 27.5 rear, Pirelli tires front and rear, DT Swiss rims, and then also my signature parts, uh, handlebar stem seat, also with my signature colorway, which I'm super stoked on, also Magura MT7 brakes. So it's actually very close to the one you can get online. Unlike the next one, that one's, let's say, a bit more special. All right, guys, probably my favorite bike I ever owned. It's called the Garden Angel. It's the Kenyan Torque with a double crown set up in front. I worked together with my designer on this project to make sure it's going to be a really outstanding paint job. And I think it definitely worked out. There's so many details, so many graphics. They are all drawn by hand, which is absolutely amazing and I just love the way of how it looks. Apart from the paint job, this bike is a pure free riding machine. I used it in France when I was riding the Black Hill, super steep terrain. And also when I did the flip to manual over a super huge kicker. It's 27.5 rear and front. I've got Pirelli tires. I've got DT Swiss rims. Other than that, also my signature parts, s seat, handlebar grips, MT7 brakes. Suspension setup might be also very interesting for you guys. I really like to ride a stiffer setup, especially on the free ride bike. Um, in the rear, I'm riding a shock with a spring. It's actually the strongest spring I could get from Erlins is 548. Then also in the front, I'm riding quite a high pressure, actually the maximum pressure from Erlins. Um, so I just want to make sure when I do big jumps or when I land that I don't instantly bottom out and that I still have a bit of room left. Um, also, I'm used to having a stiff setup from trials riding. All right, guys, that's it from the bike check. These are the bikes. I freaking love them. Let me know which one is your favorite and uh, see you guys next time. Bye bye.